Hey guys, so I've heard some great stories about some gems being found in this supermarket. So today we are headed right there to Wegmans. I've never even been here before. Have you guys been here? Has anybody been here? Have you ever found some gems here? Let me know in the comment section. Let's see what they got inside. See you in. First up, I see some palms looking very nice and lush out here for 40 bucks. And they also have a lot here. Ooh, I see them, guys. It was exciting. So here it is. Oh, they got some nice prices here. Oh, guys, is this the um, ficus? uh altissima wait no the altissima has yellow outer variegation right i have this one and they have these and these are 8.99 they also have some peru let's see how much they have it here for Oh, this one is, hmm, I don't see it. They have some Global Green Pothos, and they have the Silver Stripe, they have some Syngonium. Uh, it's pretty similar to like the other big box stores, but I haven't seen these yet in the big box stores close to me. And I forget the name of this, Shiz something. There it is. Shizma de Galatis. I haven't seen this yet. They also have some Adansonii. Oh, and I haven't seen this one either. I forget the name of this one. Guys, remind me. What's the name of it? And this guy also, I forget the name of. I'm just going blank today. Remind me of these names, guys. They also have um, Baltic Blue here. And these are all $19.99. And they have, wow, look how big this Peru is. Oh, wow, that, that was um, tricking me because there's two pots there. Wow, look at this ruby ficus. Not ruby. Um, I forget, but there's a lot of stems in there. This is by Urban Jungle. There has to be at least three plants in here growing. And then they have some lemon meringue. And more Baltic blue. Um, not from here. Oh, look at this, guys. This looks so lush and healthy. Wow, I even like the pot. My daughter just brought up that they have this moving train here. How cute is that? It's like holding all the groceries and stuff. How cute. So the jade plants are $21.99. They have some more palms. Oh, I've been wanting this. My mother-in-law has a huge one in her house, so that's the only reason why I want it. Cool. And then they have some Alocasia Bambinos, and these are all $24.99 here. Oh, look at this, guys. This is interesting. They have like an assortment, a plant assortment here. And they have ferns, and they also have a black velvet in the assortment bowl. Cool. Then they have some Dracaena, Bromeliad, and 
Anthurium here. This is a really cute setup. And then over there they have a sea of umbrella trees that look so lush and healthy. Wow, guys, look at their orchids. Wow, that is so beautiful. And they just have some little succulents here in these really cute pots. Look at that Ripley guy. And of course, they have their beautiful roses. Gypsophila, phyla, to add into an arrangement. And Solidago. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a rose person, clearly. I don't really do flowers much. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good. And they have some really, really cute ferns here. Wow, they're so healthy. And these are $13.99. And they have a Calathea here. And some Ruby Ficus. Or a rubber tree. And look at this, these variegated um, mini roses. And these are $4.99. And then over here they have some hanging baskets with some more ferns. These are $16.99. And they also have Brazil. They're so healthy and shiny. I like this basket the leaf, funky leaf shape of that one. Wow, look how huge this leaf is on this golden pothos. Such a lush pot. All right, guys, so that sums it about up for Wegmans. Let's head to the next supermarket. Next stop is one of my favorites. I have gotten a bunch of plants from here and that is Whole Foods. So let's head inside. <laughs> so when you first walk in, they have a little section here of different cacti, flowers, chatted scantium. Really cute setup. Let's see what else they have. So that was a bus. They literally just had what I showed you, that little area, and then they had like all their flower arrangements and stuff. And when I asked an associate, they were like, yep, that's all we have for now. So <sighs> disappointing, Whole Foods. I wonder if there's like um, a time where they get like new shipment or whatever and I just missed it but anyways let's head to the next one so we decided to stop at a nursery that was in um, close proximity to us um, at Whole Foods and so we decided to come to White Plains Orchids and it was actually closed but like the owner saw us pull in and they decided to let us in thank you so much Guys, look at this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So they have this begonia here. Wow, it's so big. Oh my gosh, is this a, a codex plant? No, right? Wow, look at this begonia here. They have this ZZ here. Look at the rain, the 
water system that they have. Cool. Okay, let's quickly see what they have inside since they're actually not even opened. I'm just gonna do a quick little tour. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look at all the orchids. They look fake. Oh my gosh, look how pretty the color is. Guys, look at this Monstera elbow that they have just like growing and propping it in water. These leaves are huge. Look at that. They have Raphidophora tetrasperma here. They have a Gloriosum. Wow, look at that Raphidophora. That's huge. Wow, look at all the orchids they have. Oh my goodness, look at this huge basket. Raphidophora death cursiva. Or a dragon's tail. Oh my gosh, look at this huge orchid here that just has leaves for now oh my gosh it is so beautiful here oh, look they have anthurium vecchii i don't even know what this anthurium is but it's huge oh my gosh guys we gotta go it's just so beautiful look at this big pink princess they have wow huh what's this big guy here definitely grows like a philo but I don't know what kind I didn't know sorry oh look at this crimson prince no queen no princess it's blooming. Look how many blooms it has. Wow. <laughs> Have some over here. Oh, look at this pink. How much is the pink princess? This one? Oh, um, I didn't even check. I'm sorry. No, I don't see any price. Look at this big, funky, succulent. Like, where is it going? There's more rain right here. You can feel it? Looks like they're doing some tissue culture here. Look at this big gloriosum here. This doesn't feel quick. We've only been here five minutes. All right, last but not least, we are headed to BJ's. And if anyone has found some plants in BJ's, because hubby just does not believe me, and this is my first time also heading into BJ's to see some plants that they have, let me know. Let me know if you guys have ever been shopping, grocery shopping, and found some plants. And was like, what? BJ's has plants now? Since when? All right, see you inside.
Here we are. I see some. This is it? Okay, so they have the red banana plant. No, that's not it. And they have some bromeliads, some orchids. Let's see what they have around the corner. <laughs> some more anthurium. Oh, again. What is this? Let's see. It just has foliage. I like the little basket. That's kind of cute. We have these. And just some more orchids. So I guess I came at the wrong day. Well, um, that was uneventful. I mean, they definitely had a lot though because all these empty slots. Maybe I'll come back another day. All right, guys, that's it for this one. Thanks so much for tuning back in. I really do appreciate all you guys here. I'll be having a giveaway soon, so please subscribe so you don't miss out. My next video, I will tell you what the giveaway is. I'm telling you, you don't want to miss it. Thanks so much again. Plants in Paradise, out.